Funding for this program was provided by the Annenberg CPB Project. Hello? Yes, is this Dr. Professor Newt Einstein? Yes, this is Mrs. Hughes. Um, my two sons, they're having a terrible time in physics. Is it possible for you to come tutor them? Yeah, I'll be there faster than electrons moving through a cold, short, thick wire. Ha ha ha! Oh, wonderful. Exactly how long will that be? Show me where the kids are at. Uh, Call of Duty is so fun. Call your sisters right now. Out of your rooms now! Get ready to learn! Alright, class. Today we are learning about projectile motion. That's when we throw things and they come back to the ground in a parabolic curve, like this. Understand? Yes, Mr. Cox. How do you spell projectile motion? P. R. U. Suck it light! Well, thanks, Professor. Professor? Yes, Paul? Can I have a bathroom break? What? Can I go to the bathroom? Mr. Cox, take it off! In front of everyone? Yes. Enough! Take the hair off, please. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, time's up. See what you guys got done. Oh, Paul. Good. Good. <laughs> Do it again. Mr. Cox, how about you? What do you have done? I think you'll like it, Professor. This is exactly what I was looking for, Mr. Cox. Well, thanks, Newt Einstein. It's Mr. Dr. Professor Newt Einstein to you. My apologies. What's that noise? Con lo no, I pause in class. Cox? Stop. Stop. Knock it off! They do the Harlem Shake.
I don't get any of this. What do you mean you don't get this? stuff's so easy. What are you doing? What do you mean you don't get this? We went over it a thousand times. I think it's time for a little hands-on activity. What do you guys think? Dude, get off me. What are you doing? Don't ask questions. Class, now for the hands-on experiment, we're going to be going outside. Where's Mr. Cox? He lets his work here. Ready, Paul? Ready. This won't hurt a bit. It might actually hurt a lot. <laughs> Wipe those tears off your face. You act like it hurts, dude. It does. Oh, come on. Professor New Einstein? Yes, Mr. Cox. Please do. Oh. Nothing. What physics professor Larson is trying to explain is a basic property of projectile motion. That is that horizontal displacement is equal to the initial velocity times time plus half of acceleration due to gravity times time squared. What we know is that Paul is standing at a distance of 41.2 meters from the paintball gun, and we know that it took approximately 0.45 seconds for the paintball to hit him. By plugging in the, these numbers into the equation and already knowing the acceleration of gravity, we can quickly solve for the initial velocity of the paintball gun. The velocity comes out to be around 91.46 meters per second, which is equal to 300 feet per second. Now do you guys understand? Is it that simple? Mr. Cox, wake up! <sighs> I had the worst nightmare. Mr. Blaha posted a new seating chart. I was next to Kaylee. Oh, dear. Uh, you're okay, Mr. Cox. You're here with me right now. You're okay. Physics. 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 They see me bowing my front lawn. I know they're all thinking I'm so wide and nerdy. I think I'm just too wide and nerdy. I think I'm just too wide and nerdy. Can't you see I'm white and nerdy? Look at me, I'm white and nerdy.